ever wondered what it's like to have screws on your head? My first operation was my cast and reception. The hard piece at home was getting to sleep with my leg sticked up. The hard piece at school was having to get bounced on the toilet. Here was like poles. Four poles and it's got like this black thing that goes around your head mm -hmm. with screws in. And tell with me about it. Lampful vest with bullet like bulletproof on top. Keep my head straight while the uh, metal plate was working in my head. Mm -hmm. We're well, getting straightened anyway. Okay. And how did that all make you feel when you were having this put on for the first time? Um, scared. Did you know what it was going to be before they put it on? Or was it? No. No. So when the first, can you describe the first time you you saw it and felt it? Um, well, I didn't. Well, I can tell you this. When I woke up and I kept on doing that, I went, "Mom, what's that? Mom, what's that?" And she never answered until the last time I said it. Then she answered. I was a bit scared. I knew that it was going to be painful. Oh yeah. That time someone took my blood and it was a boy and I said, hurry up or otherwise I'll punch you. <laughs> and a screw came loose in my head. That was stupid. And so I had to go back and get it took out. How did you know that this, this screw had, had come loose? Because my mum always, like, I got a headache and my mum checked them like with her hands and she found one loose so and then every two weeks I had to go and get them tightened when I was awake. Mm -hmm. Awake and get them tightened. I told my doc I asked my doctor if I could smash it here. But anyway it makes it happen. Like they came out and put a banister because I was stairs that go into the house so they put a the hospital put a bouncer for us to get up and an extra bouncer on the other side of the wall because the other bouncer was too high for us. Now I'm literally high bouncer. Yeah. In school I have a cushion on the seat to boost us up so I can reach the table. And a box to put my feet on. Can you imagine what it's like to be me?